Hi boys and girls, happy Monday, and you know Mondays are meant for famous fails. Let me get my presentation up. And we have a special guest with us for famous fails today, Mr. B. So he is going to be in on our video today. Are you going to stay in the frame? There you go. All right, maybe. Okay. Well, I guess he's going to stay behind me. So we need to tell him about our famous fails for Mondays. So we do famous fails on Mondays because it is the start of our week and sometimes we need to know mistakes are proof that we are trying. Would you agree with that? Mm -hmm. Good, good. All right, so let's see if we can guess. Let me put my little face up here. Maybe I'll make myself a little smaller. Let's see if we can guess who our famous fail is today. Mr. B, do you think you can guess? Lucille Ball. No, that was another week. So let's take a look. Here's your first hint. Music. Correct. Here's your second hint. Austria. Sound of Music. No. Maria Von Trapp. Ooh, good guess. And if you know Sound of Music, let me know. Um, no, it is actually Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Do you know Mozart? I know Amadeus. There you go. So let me read you guys a little bit about him. He's a classical composer. Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart began composing at the age of five. Five years old. Do you know five? who's five years old? Me? No. Oh. Emma. Oh, Emma's five. That makes sense. Okay, he wrote over 600 pieces of music that are still considered some of the best pieces ever written. He was dismissed from his position as a court musician in Salzburg. He died with very little. His music became famous after he died. Boys and girls, imagine that. That after he died, that's when everyone started to really love his music. People got to know his music. He wasn't even alive to really know how much people love it. And here's his quote. It says, It is a mistake to think that the practice of my art has become easy to me. Okay? The minute that you think that something really becomes easy, that means you got to step it up a bit. Okay? And I'm going to play you guys just a little bit. Is it rap? It's not rap. It's oh. classical music. Let's listen just a little bit. Here's a video that I have from YouTube. Um, I'm just going to play, like, the melody just so you can hear some of Mozart. Rondo, I'll let most of the this. Have you ever heard that melody before? Okay, that's one of his most popular um, compositions. And today, boys and girls, Mozart always wanted a career in music. From the age of five, he knew that he really wanted to do something with music. Boys and girls, I'll tell you one thing about me. I didn't always want to be a teacher. You didn't? No. Um, I knew I wanted to work with kids. I knew I wanted to make a difference. Um, but I didn't know that was going to be through teaching. And I bet you if you asked me when I started teaching six years ago, if I was going to be teaching through a computer all the time, I would probably say... I'm not a gambling person. Okay, um, that I would not, I would not bet on that, that, oh, I get the gambling, okay, um, thing now. But I want you guys to comment either below on this post, however you want to, um, let me know what do you want to be when you're older, okay? Um, maybe you have a big dream of being some type of athlete, let me know that, have those dreams. Because um, look, it worked out for Mozart, but was it easy always? No, because he said no. <laughs> okay. It's hard sometimes, and we have to keep on trying. So I hope you guys have a great Monday and a great rest of your week.